now removed. They sprinting away and colour my fate a little bit slow out of the gaze. One of the first starters, Garrulous, is in the orange, but a little bit strong. Along the inside, action-packed. Eric the Red is right there shortly after the start, then Bold Horizon. Pray for Rain is on the outside with the gold cap amongst the leading group. Captain Maris goes about three lengths off the leader. Action packed is further back in the run and then comes the contractor. Dandola's on the outside and then behind that one is Ty Gold and Colour My Fate. There's a bit of scrimmaging out the back of the field but they're compact. There's only about seven lengths from top to tail. And Pray for Rain will bring them in. Captain Marisco second. Garrelis is in the orange in third. Then Eric the Red treads swiftly. Action packed is towards the inside. The outside of that one, Dandola's trying to put in a claim. Pray for rain. Garrulous moves in. Captain Marisco, Eric the Red as they come down to the last 200 metres. Garrulous now takes it up. Eric the Red's running on strongly. Pray for rain and then on the outside, Captain Marisco, Garrulous and Eric the Red over the last 200. It's close. It goes to Eric the Red. Second to Garrulous and then pray for rain. Number nine, Eric the Red will win it, and it pays up 380, will win the last jump, will ends up winning by about a neck. Number nine, Eric the Red, they changed the shoe, the front shoe at the start, wins it. Second to number two, the tote favourite, Garrulous. Third to number 12, Pray for Rain. The fourth position will go to number one, Action Pact and Captain Marisco. It's very close between those two. Let's wait for the judges, then the contractor and tread swiftly. So Eric the Red, number nine, took a while to get into its stride as Garrulous took it up. Pray for Rain as between the two horses and Captain Marisco on the outside. But Eric the Red, this one for Farsfontein Stud, Sue Kelmanson and Farsfontein Stud, Captain L, Justin Snaith, they're victorious, the fifth win from eight and they win race number four the pick six pool got to the over eight million race five starts off the jackpot back to the studio uh, let's get uh, justin snaith in justin he's been a super horse i've had the, the... Well. <laughs> He's a, he's, he's a super horse, Justin. Uh, you're doing superbly well with him down in Cape Town. I've had the, the pleasure of uh, interviewing uh, Susan and yourself and the team whilst he was winning all those races. And prior to this win, he, you gave him two good runs in two features. Yeah, look, he's a, he's a young horse, so um, you've got to remember they're they coming to tracks for the first time. So, you know, when you ran in Scottsville, it's the first time at the racetrack. And then when you ran here last time, it's the first time He's had to negotiate a, a turn, so um, uh, it, it's, it's, it's a lot harder than it looks, I must be honest, and uh, it, I'm very impressed the way he's handled it. And the good thing is, if he comes back as a three-year-old, he's had the advantage of looking at um, all the different tracks. So, over the moon, uh, really well done to Fast Fontaine, Susan Culmanson, everybody at Fast Fontaine. He's a special horse. Um, when he arrived, Carl the Foss said to me, and Amanda said, um, look after our next stallion. So. There was no pressure to start with, and so far it's looking like he's going the right way. Was the mild race an option on today's card? It was, but when we drew badly, we decided not to. Um, the mile is quite tricky from a, from a wide draw, so uh, just um, I think this is, this is the right race for the right, at the right time. It was a competitive race. I mean, every race is competitive today. It's a, uh, if I had to say, uh, as a race day goes, it's the most competitive race day in South Africa, I think. Uh, nothing's going to be easy today, and... Uh, uh, you've never seen such hungry uh, trainers ever in South African history at the moment, so it's making it very hard. Richard uh, gave the thumbs up for Casimir. Anything else from the stable? As I said, um, pressure's on. We're hoping for a good day. So uh, the horses are well, um, and uh, we're just hoping for good results. Just for Do It Again fans, the guys that are, are, you know, are in his camp in a big way today, how's he taken his Vodacom Durban July run, and how's he doing? Look, he's doing very well. Eh? This year, he, had to, he didn't have to do a canter pass, so he's still fresh. Thanks, Justin. <laughs> uh, a right, thanks. momento for you on behalf of the sponsor, e -Paul, and Fast Fontaine as well. Well done to winning trainer Justin well. saying Well done to uh, the Kelmersons. And uh, the winning groom, his name is Alpheus uh, in Zulu. Alpheus, well done to you. And uh, that will conclude race number four.
The Amkumazi Stakes, Grade 2, sponsored by Ipoh, will belong to horse number nine, Eric the Red.